Welcome back to the review and today I'm going to take a look at the Star Trek A Celebration book. This is about TOS, the original series, a retrospective as it says here. And it's so brand new, it's still wrapped. Let's take this off and there you go. This is the book. Front, back, the spine. Let's open this up. What if I take this off? Star Trek A Celebration in black. Why not? There you go. Front, back, spine. And there you go. Ooh, Hero Collectors. I do have that in the back. I have all of these and I'm going to go through these as well. That's pretty cool. So this is the smell of new. Again, I've never looked at this before. So let's go through. We have Star Trek, ooh, classic photo, of course. Here's your content. It's a lot, 256 pages as it is marked here. You can see all the characters it's going through. There's a special thanks and forward. Wagon train to the stars. Now this is a bigger book, so I'm going to flip through these a bit faster. Ooh, but of course I haven't seen this yet, so I'm probably going to stop at some moments where it's awesome. Definitely starting with the very, very beginning here. Original characters of the original pilot. To boldly go, then we're switching over to the redo with Kirk. The opening narration. Cool. Aha, uh -huh. we're going to the classic character with the old classic almost sweater style uniform. Then switching over to the new ones. Oh, season one pilot episode every day. So we're going through an episode. Actually, just briefly, I guess here. Second character, we got Spock. Nice. It's a lot of pages about him. That's awesome. Different haircut here. That's weird to see. <laughs> Looks almost like uh, his son when you look at him now here. Of course he would. Cool. Lieutenant Alden. Corbett Maneuver. Okay, so it's usually two pages for an episode. That's interesting. Dr. McCoy Bones. We got another character here going through the Vulcans. Okay, two pages on the Vulcans. All right, we're continuing classic character. Romulans, two pages. Arena, another episode. And then Montgomery Scott. New one, JJ, just a brief mention. The Klingons and the many changing faces. Uhura of the Klingons. Uhura is awesome too. Lots of pages, that's great. Ooh, bringing in Guinan. Space Seed, another classic episode. Sulu, of course, of course, they had to include that photo. The Devil in the Dark, that's a good one too. Chekhov, that's quite the photo. Definitely a young actor on that show. Hmm, there seem to be most pages dedicated. Ah, I think a few less pages for Chekhov. All right, new character, this side of Paradise. Nurse Chapel, also the wife and the voice of the computer. The City on the Edge of Forever, a fantastic episode. Ooh, we're going into props. Phaser, oh, company. Uh, back to an actor, two pages, yes. Ooh, designing the ship inside and out. That's cool. I like that. Yes, classic design. Seen this a couple of pages. That's very cool. Interior. Oh, I love this. This is great. Oh, okay. Guest cameos. Another episode. The communicator. Writers. Oh, that's cool. Let's talk about the writers. I like this. That's great. She was actually in Next Generation as Dr. Pulaski. Tricorder. Oh, yes. Mirror, mirror. Talking about casting. Oh, art department. I like this. Cool. That's actually very cool. I was just talking about something like this from the Castlevania art of book where it was mostly finished art. And I love seeing this. Just a little, you know, it's a bit more on the, on the sketchier side before this and then that. Not that these are the very, very first explorations, but it's still cool to see that, how it just progresses. <laughs> yes, I'm a doctor, not a... Shuttlecraft, awesome. Ooh, never seen this before. That's cool. Harry Mud, yes. Also going to say in Discovery, the new casting here. These are <laughs> those classic makeup prosthetic jobs. Oh, yes. Classic episode two. Dressing for the future. That, that's cool. Yes, I love seeing that. Mark Leonard, also classic, showing up in uh, Next Generation and beyond. Movies as well, it's great. Make it green. Ah, oh, yes. Clint Howard, 
the brother of Ron Howard. Oh, yes. Look at that. Classic. Classic. It was, as, as I was saying, <laughs> the makeup job. Oh, yes. Wow. I kind of forgot about that one. That's cool. Old. Also in next generation. They took over. The Gorn. Yes. Inside the monsters. Classic episode. That's awesome. The salt monster. It's the last of its kind. Trouble with Tribbles. Classic episode. Also taking over to uh, Deep Space Nine. That's a great moment. Ooh, directors. That's cool. More characters. Klingon ship. Yes. Ooh, nice. Very cool. Like that. Look at this. I love seeing stuff like this. That's great. All those planet orbiting shots. Love seeing stuff like this. This is so cool. It's a huge, huge model. Botany Bay in the lower left there. People always laugh about this episode. I have to say, I like it. <laughs> Dare I say, I like that episode. Just like the one with Lazarus. Those are cool. Classic map paintings. The Enterprise Incidents. Post-production. Look at this. Classic. Oh, yes. Music department. There's so many now new released uh, soundtracks, including the animated show, which is so great. Ooh, we got all the episodes here, right? So season one, season two, and season three. Still some good stuff in season three. A bit less than two and one. That's cool. Oh, yes. I was listening to the Glorious Trexpert. So we were just talking about this. I so wish I could do this. I would love to see that set. And that's it. Further reading. The end in gray and black. And there you go. Oh, my Enterprise D here. Star Trek A Celebration. That is very cool. Again, brand new. I haven't read any of those pages. So I can't wait to dig into this. And as I was showing before, these kinds are really cool too. This will be for a different review, but you can see it's awesome in terms of props and sets and costume. They go really into massive detail about everything and I have them all. They're great. So that is going to be a review for another time. So Star Trek, a celebration, brand new. I love it. Just a classic show. It, it gets never gets old. I just love getting more and more Star Trek stuff. It just, as you can see, it's full. My room, everything is full of Star Trek. I love it. But that is it. Thank you for watching my flip through of the book. And if that's something that you like, leave a comment. Let me know what other books you want to see. I just got Pan's Labyrinth upon a request. Also awesome. There's a lot more. Pumped to go back into my review schedule. But that's it. Thank you for watching. And if you like that stuff, feel free to subscribe and, and hit the like button. You know, the pitch at the end. But if you like this, you don't want to miss anything, definitely hit that bell button. And that's it for me. If you're still watching, as always, thank you for your patience. Thank you for watching to the very end. And that's it. I will see you in my next upload.